this shrub has kind of begun to overgrow the sidewalk here and take over a little more space than was provided for it in this particular garden. And we do have snow plows that come along this driveway to clear it out during the winter months and we have traffic that comes through here in the summer months. We don't want the tree to get damaged by the traffic on it and we don't want to do any damage to the equipment by leaving the tree growing over that space. Evergreen trees grow from the tips or the buds on the ends of each branch and you want to make sure when you're cutting things back that you leave branches or tips that have those buds on it so that there is a growing point on the branch. If you cut too far into the tree you can cut all the needles off and then the plant cannot produce its own energy and you'll end up just having a dead branch. So you may have to do a little fine pruning to get it back into the space in the garden. Um, the amount that's hanging over the sidewalk here is a small amount of what the overall tree is. So I really don't have to worry about cutting off too much of it. But if you are doing a major pruning project, you wanna make sure that you never take off more than a quarter of the branches with needles on it or leaves on it in one, one year. So if you have a large project to do, you may have to do it over multiple years. For the University of Wyoming Extension, this is Donna Quinn and you're watching From the Ground Up.